Dr. May? Good morning. It's time to take your medicine. Bombastic side eye. No, Miss Applewood. There'll be no side eyeing today. Now take your medicine. <sighs> you really thought you ate that? No, I don't. But you need to eat your medicine. No, I don't want my medication. I want girl dinner. After you take your medicine. Girl dinner. No, please don't start singing again. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. All right, unplug your life support. Miss Applewood, you soiled yourself. Come on, let's go and get you cleaned up. No, I'm in my pooping my pants era. What happened to your clean girl era? Let's bring that back. Clean girl aesthetic. Exactly. Now let's go get washed up. You're giving me the ick. You're giving me the ick because you smell so bad. Where'd you get that? What are you eating? My husband. Today, we will be making our last girl dinner. Miss Applewood, are you on your phone again? Your grandchildren don't want you to have too much screen time. Mind your business, Susan! What is our dessert? Moldy muffins. Yes, that's my favorite food. I need my glasses. Cake? No, no, no. Too sweet, too sweet. Need some mold on it. Pizza? No, no. Too cheese. Too much cheese! No! Yes. Yes. Toenail clippings. What's my drink? Wash it all down with the 7-Up. Good. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. Hummus? Delectable. Red olives? All right. No, 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 no. I'm not taking my vitamins. Miss Applewood, you need to take your vitamins. No, I told you I'm not taking my vitamins, Susan. <sighs> See, this is why I told you to stop yelling so much. I don't yell. Anyways, scrumdiddlyumptious. Miss Applewood, your grandchildren are here to see you. Tell them to go home. I'm busy. You're not busy. I'm trying to see what kind of dog I am. Ah! Today I will be seeing who has a crush on me. Six, five, ha! I would climb that like a tree. Miss Applewood, what did you just say? No one's talking to you, Susan. Bartender, I don't know because I'm a material girl. He doesn't make that much money. Cancer, oh, he's a 10 out of 10 in looks. <laughs> no one would ever have a crush on you, Miss Applewood, because you're not a very nice lady. That's not true, Susan. I have a husband. Now, what is this filter? I'm a fan. Hmm. Ah! Susan! Susan! Why are you spinning? I don't know, but make it stop! Mrs. Applewood lived a long life, but unfortunately, one dreadful day she turned into a fan and she couldn't stop spinning. Not even Susan could he pee her. Bombastic side eye. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. Slay. It's worse than I thought, Doctor. Her dementia is progressing fast. All she can remember is internet sayings from back in her day. My name is Jeff. It's not looking good, Susan. Let me ask her some basic questions. What's 9 plus 10? 21. This isn't good. She doesn't even know basic math. Miss Applewood, do you remember me? What's my name? Who am I? You're a pain in my ass. I'm about like the Barbie. Susan, play Barbie World. Nurse Susan's not on this floor anymore. Who are you? I'm Nurse Jennifer. I'll be taking care of you from now on. No, 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 no. Get Susan. Get Susan. I don't want you. I want Susan. Susan doesn't want to see you. Now take your heart medicine and vitamins. I don't take my medicine. And Susan knows that. And she knows I don't take my vitamins. I want Susan here. If you were nice to Susan, she wouldn't have requested to change floors. <sighs> Whatever. I'll go get her myself. Miss Applewood, no. Hey, stop running. Choose to speak to your soulmate. Or choose to speak to your mom. My mom passed away when I was three years old. How could I speak to her? Hello, sweetie. Mom? Mom, is that really you? Yes, it is really me. I'm so regretful that I couldn't be in your life more. It really is you. There's so much I've wanted to tell you. Hey, mom? Yes, sweetie? I have a date tonight. I really like him. Aw, that's wonderful. Will you help me choose an outfit for it later? I've always dreamed of my mom helping me get ready for my first date. Of course. 
Mom, these questions are really hard. Could you help me? Who are you talking to? I'm talking to my mom. She's dead. I got a choice this morning to talk to either my mom or my soulmate. Brianna, I don't want to tell you this, but that is not your mom. Brianna, I don't want to be the one to tell you this, but that is not your mom. I am your real mother. She doesn't know what she's talking about. She doesn't even know me. You're right. You think you know my own mother better than I do? You're just never happy for me. Brianna, wait. Ella's mom, what are you doing here? Ella never came home from school yesterday. Since you're her best friend, I thought you might know where she went. I don't. I'm sorry. Jake, we have to cancel our date tonight. My best friend's missing. I'm really worried about her. That's no problem. Get some rest. Bye. You've been talking to Jake a lot recently. Yeah, I really like him. Honey, hurry downstairs. I have a surprise for you. Surprise! Ella, Jake, I don't think they're breathing. Since you like them so much, I brought them to you. Hmm, I'm in love with Timmy. Here, do the flower test. Yummy! No, don't eat it. To know if Timmy really loves you, you must do the flower test. Flower test? You must rip off each individual petal saying he loves me, he loves me not. If the final petal lands on he loves you, then he loves you. If the last petal lands on he does not, then he doesn't. He loves me. He loves me not. He loves me. He loves me not. He loves me. He loves me not. Sweetie, what's wrong? Timmy doesn't love me. Why didn't Daddy come to pick me up at school too? He went to pick up milk. He's never coming back. Hello, daughter. Dad? I'm sorry I left. I want to be in your life again. Ten years later and you want to be back in my life? Only if the flower says you really love me. Hello, daughter. Dad? I'm sorry I left. I want to be in your life again. Ten years later and you want to be back in my life? Only if the flower says you really love me. He loves me? He loves me not. He loves me? He loves me not. You don't love me, Dad. Of course I love you. You're my daughter. Why'd you come back? Look, I need some money. I just need you to ask your mother. Not gonna happen. Why don't you go pick up milk like you said you were going to ten years ago? Hey, baby. Are you okay? I love you. He loves me. He loves me not. He loves me. I love you too. I now pronounce you husband and- Wait. I need you to do the flower test. Right now? I now pronounce you husband and- Wait. I need you to do the flower test. Right now? Yes, I have to be sure. She loves me. She loves me not. She loves me. She loves me not. You don't love me. Why would you agree to marry me if you don't love me? I thought I did, but I wasn't sure. No. You knew. Because if you really loved me, you wouldn't even have to think about it. Truthfully, there's someone else. <gasps> I'm sorry. Well, that was embarrassing. I love you, Timmy. Brianna, I love you too. I've loved you since I was six years old. What? But I did the flower test and you didn't love me back. It must have been wrong. Try it again. The flower test doesn't lie. Please, just one more time. He loves me. He loves me not. Sweetie, is it time for school? Yes, I think so. Sweetie, you need to ask, what time is it, Mr. Wolf? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 8 a.m. It's time for school. Mmm, lunchtime. Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 12 p.m. It's time for everybody to eat lunch. Except, Timmy. It's time for Timmy to be my lunch. No, Mr. Wolf, please! What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for me to eat you. <laughs> Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. Hurry! What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for me to eat you. <laughs> Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. Hurry! What, 
time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for everyone to go home. It's time to go home. I'll see you tomorrow, Bestie. Stay safe. You too. Mom, I'm home. I'm so hungry. Mom, is it time for dinner? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 5 p.m. It's time for me to have my dinner. <laughs> Mom! Sissy, where's Mommy? It's time for dinner. She's just sleeping. Why is there a timer above my head? Sissy, hurry. You need to ask. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? Ask what? Why is there a timer above my head? Sissy, hurry. You need to ask. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? Ask what? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? What time is it, Mr. Who? Mr. Wolf! Mr. Wolf! Uh-oh. Looks like little sissy ran out of time. It's time to be my no. meal. <laughs> Go away. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 9 a.m. It's time for school. You're late. I don't care. I'm not going. My mom and sister are gone. What? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 9 a.m. It's time for you to go to school. I told you I'm not going. Red Rover, Red Rover, we call Brianna over. Mommy, there's little girls calling me. You need to find them. They'll be holding hands and you need to break through or they'll take you. <laughs> Come join us, Brianna. You're almost out of time. Ah! This morning, little girls called me to play Red Rover. My mommy says it's not real. It's just a myth. It's a fake story. You're lying. No, it's not. I saw them. I had to break through their hands. Stop lying. Red Rover, Red Rover, we call Ellie over. Who's there? Who's calling me? Ellie, do you hear them? The little girls? You need to find them and break through or they'll take you. I don't believe you. Hurry up. You only have 20 seconds. No, no, it's not real. Ellie, hurry up. Do you hear them, the little girls? You need to find them and break through or they'll take you. I don't believe you. Hurry up. You only have 20 seconds. No, no, it's not real. Ellie, hurry up. Come join us, Ellie. Ellie, you survived. I know, I'm so lucky. So it is real. The game of Red Rover? Yes, it is. I saw them, the little girls. I told you guys it was real. You didn't believe me. Red Rover, Red Rover. We call Katie over. Don't play Red Rover. The little girls might hear you and call you over. We are the little girls. So that means they, they, they took us. And you're going to be next. No, no, please tell me you're joking. <laughs> Brianna, I like you. Ew, Timmy! Ugh. Ugh. Why did I just get money? Mommy, today at school when Timmy said he liked me, I got money. Money, that's because every time someone has a crush on you, you get money. You're saying I could be rich? Hey girl, do you want to go to the mall after school? I can't. I'm broke. How are you broke? Just go get boys to like you. I don't know how to get boys to like me. It's easy. Just do the bend and snap method. Bend and snap method? Drop something on the floor and go to pick it up. Hey, boys. Don't talk to us. Oops. Whoa. I got it. Bro, I caught that on VO. That bend and snap method of yours really works. I'm making big. It's because of this. Look, the video the boys took of you went viral. <gasps> no way. Uh-oh, Brianna? Uh-oh, Brianna? There's a new video. You might want to see this. Oops. Whoa. I got it. You said it's giving boys the ick. When someone crushes on you, you get money. But if you give them the ick, you lose it. But it's not fair. I didn't fart, and I don't really look like that. No, I've almost lost all of my crushes. Does it say who posted that video? It was Jake. Jake! Hey, Farty. Chad, where's Jake? I'm not telling you. Look, it's Farty Pin. Jake! Jake, take the video down. It's making me lose all my money and my crushes. I'm not taking the video down because I don't want you to have any crushes. Why not? Because I'm in love with you. Huh? Huh? Oh my. 
Someone made another edit of you. Huh? Oh my. Someone made another edit of you. It's Barty Pit. Jake. What the? Who even took that video? I took it. I saw you standing there so lovely, and I just couldn't help myself. Timmy, you still have a crush on me? Brianna, marry me, please. Just give me a chance. Come on, let's get out of here. Hey, are you all right? They were a little crazy. Yeah, I'm fine. Maybe having so many crushes isn't that great. Don't worry. I'll protect you. Brianna, did you see that new edit of you? You must have lots of new crushes now. Yeah, I did. I have enough money to go with you to the mall after school now. Hey, Brianna, I really enjoyed spending time with you today. I really like you. Do you think maybe we could go on a date sometime? Jake, I've had a crush on you for years. But when you tried to destroy my image, that gave me the ick. Bombastic? Bombastic? Oh no, Jimmy, did you just get a TikTok sound? You have to say the rest of the sound. Answer carefully, because if you answer it wrong, you die. Bombastic. They call Mr. Bombastic. Bomba fantastic. No, Jimmy! <laughs> it was Bombastic sign I. Are you off to school, honey? Yeah, Grandma. We need cash. We need cash. Why am I hearing voices? Oh no. Grandma, did you just get a TikTok sound? You have to say the rest of it. We need cash. Give me my money, you world. Grandma! Grandma! <laughs> I'm on Mexican radio. Hey girl, how are you doing today? Not good. My grandma can finish the rest of the TikTok sound this morning. I said him. I said him. Brianna, what's wrong? I just got a TikTok sound. I said a... Come on, you have to say the rest of the sound. I said a boom. Come on, hurry. I'm trying to think. I said a boom, chicka boom. I said a boom, chicka rocka, chicka rocka, chicka boom. I got it. I'm so glad you're safe. Come on, let's go to class. Okay. Okay. What is this? You just got a TikTok sound, didn't you? I know this one. What are you doing? What were we just about to do? I think I know the rest of the sound. Okay, let's go to class. <laughs> no! It was okay, let's go. There's my beautiful girlfriend. What's wrong, baby? My best friend couldn't say the TikTok sound correctly. I think I'm just gonna go home early today. One, two. One, two. I just got a TikTok sound. One, two. Babe, I know the answer for this one. One, two. Buckle my shoe. No, babe, you're not allowed to give the answer. You're only allowed to give a hint. I forgot. <laughs> Baby. Answer now or be eliminated. One, two. Buckle my shoe. Three, four. Buckle some more. Five, six. Nike kicks. Where do you think you're going? Out? Jump scare. I'm going home. No, you're not allowed to leave the school without a note from your mother. My boyfriend just passed away. That's not my problem. Now go to class. Mommy, look what I can do. What the? Mommy? Mommy? That's not something you should be calling one of your students. No, it's a TikTok sound. Mommy, look what I can do. Mommy, look what I can do. What are you doing? I'm giving you a hint. It's an audio from this amazing POV Girls video. I don't know the answer. She must be a nobody. It was Ewa Ewa. Principal's gone. That means I can finally go home. No, you can't go. You have to learn. Let me go, Eugene. Side eye. Side eye? Did you just get a TikTok sound? You're not smart enough to guess it right. <laughs> Side eye. Let her go, Eugene. Timmy. Let's get out of here. Thanks for getting me out of there, Timmy. Eugene is really weird. It was no problem. Anyways, I'm heading home now. You know what it never was? I just got a TikTok sound. You know what it never was? Uh, that's serious. It was never that serious. Timmy, you got it. I'm safe. Anyways, I'll see you later. Bye. You're not going anywhere. Frick. You're not going anywhere. Frick. Frick. This is going to be a problem, isn't it? Timmy, please just let me go home. I want to see my family. At least you have a home. A family? Everyone I know and love is gone because I couldn't say the TikTok sound correctly. If I don't get to see my family again, neither do you. Say bye bye, Brianna. Ashley! Ashley? I just got TikTok sound. Give me a hint now. Ashley. 
look at the floor. Actually, look at the floor. You really thought I'd give you the right hint, Timmy? It was Ashley, look at me. There you are, now get to class! Just leave me alone, Eugene! Okay, well, that's interesting. You need to learn! Okay, well, that's interesting. You know why? Why? Because... Honey, you're home early. Mom, today's my worst day. When is this game gonna end? Happy, happy, happy! Oh, no. Bye, Mom, I'm off to school. Don't go to school. Don't go. Actually, I'm not going to school today. I feel sick. Hello? Brianna, are you okay? Are you somewhere safe? Yeah, I'm fine. I just didn't go to school today. Well, it's a good thing you didn't. There were masked intruders at our school. Some people didn't make it out safely. And the worst part is, the police haven't caught them yet. One second. Chad's calling. Hey, baby. I miss seeing you today. Yeah, I missed you too, baby. Am I still coming over? No, don't let Chad come over. Chad, it's actually best if you don't come today. But I want to see you. I miss- Hello? Help, help, let me in. Someone's chasing me. Please, don't let her in. Hello? Help, help, let me in. Someone's chasing me. Please, don't let her in. Hurry, they're chasing me. Who? Who's chasing you? I don't know, some crazy people wearing masks. Are they close? No, they're far away. Hurry. She's lying. Open up, they found me. <coughs> You're coming with me. Ah, help, help. Mom, where are you? When are you coming home? I'm 15 minutes away. I'm stuck in traffic. Tell her not to come. Don't let her come. Mom, you can't come home right now. Why not? You just can't. Just don't come. Hey, baby. How are you feeling? Chad, how did you get in here? Your window was open. Be careful. Oops, I dropped my... I'll get it. Chad, why do you have a mask? Because you're next. <laughs> Mommy, I have hearts all over my face. Oh, you got your hearts, but you only have three. Those hearts represent the amount of times you're allowed to be heartbroken. Every time someone breaks your heart, you lose one of your hearts. So what happens if I have no hearts left? You die. <gasps> hey, besties. <clears throat> Pizza face. <laughs> Jake, stop it. You can't sit with us. Everyone's looking at you because of all your pimples on your face. It's embarrassing. It's just a little breakout. I've been really stressed recently. You can't sit with us. Is my acne really that bad? <gasps> a heart's missing. That means they broke my heart. Hey, babe. Bro, what's all over your face? Yeah, babe, what happened? It's just pimples. It will go away. <laughs> That's your girl, bro? She's not my girl. I'm not. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. Whoa, Brianna looks hot. Hey, girl, come sit with us. Yesterday, when you said I couldn't sit with you guys, you made me lose a heart. I can't trust you guys won't break my heart again. You never even deserved it in the first place. Babe, you look so good today. I'm not your babe. Yesterday, you didn't want to be with me because I had pimples. You made me lose a heart. I only have one left because of you. I can't trust you won't break my heart again. I'm sorry. Class, we have a new student today. Everyone meet John. You can sit wherever you like, John. Hey, can I sit here? Sure, do whatever you want. Lucky me. I get to sit next to the prettiest girl in the class. Look, I'm not interested. I can't risk getting involved with another person again. Hey, wait, why did you say you can't risk getting involved with another person? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left too. How about we take the risk together? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left too. How about we take the risk together? Okay, let's try it then. But just know, if you break my heart, you'll be considered a murderer. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, babe. Hey, can I ask what happened to your other hearts? How'd they get broken? My best friends and boyfriend broke my heart because they didn't like the way I looked. You may not notice, but I have really bad acne under all this makeup. That's so superficial. I would never do that to you. Wow, you're so strong and muscular. <laughs> Thanks. I want to kiss you. Brittany, I... Why would you- John? It's not what it looks like. Brianna, she came on to me. I saw you. You kissed her. You don't have any hearts left. Brianna! Good, you're awake. How am I alive? 
Where's John? Who do you think gave you the heart? He gave you his last one.